Ooh, what you say? Here we go. Ow. <laughs> What's going on fellow Drops fans? I am Haley once again. I was and continue to be Haley. Here at our Pink Room studio at the Fellow Storefront and Playground in San Francisco, California. Ready to talk to you about a super, super cool exclusive drop that we are doing with our friends over at Say. Uh, it's a Kenya Kemangara AB. It's super, super delicious. Um, really like lemon, grapefruit, rose, jelly, peachy also like with some structured like stone fruity peach jam um deliciousness <laughs> really i know that was like a lot of stuff that i just threw at you but i'm super super excited so once again this is an exclusive drop from our friends say and us to you thanks so much guys for dropping this exclusively with us say friends say rotates in a number of small lot uh really special coffees throughout the year concentrating on quality, concentrating on economic responsibility and transparency as well. And of course, just transparency in general. Now, uh, before we get into talking about why this coffee is cool AF and what it tastes like and all the good stuff about mouthfeel and things, um, I'm gonna tell you my brew recipe. So I am brewing 24.5 grams of coffee in, 350 grams out, so a little bit of a heavier dose. Um, temp is 210 degrees just below boiling and grind setting is three and two thirds with Ode with SSP. I'd suggest a two and two thirds on standard Ode. Um, medium fine is where I'm, where, how I'm approaching this coffee. Um, I'm going to let it bloom about 40 seconds and then I'm going to break and go to my second pour, which is 150 grams. Again, with the concentric circles, I would compare my concentric circles to that of kind of like a snail shell or the Fibonacci sequence for all you nerds out there like me. I am brewing at a heavier dose and a higher temperature because the way that Say roasts their coffee is really interesting. You can really, really push and push and push without bridging into that over extraction just by the nature of their roast profiles. And that's why I'm just upping the dose and really just pushing a lot out. They're super light but also very developed in a structured, nuanced complexity. So you really want to push a lot out in this way. Now this coffee is tasting to us, is tasting us in the cup and also when we brewed it, super peachy stone fruit, also some like rose jelly. Um, it's got like a really nice structured mouthfeel with a bunch of florals in it too. And the lemon grapefruit comes out in that like nice dazzling acidity. Um, it is a field blend, so uh, a number of different varietals coming from the same area. Um, it's coming from the Kebangara Coffee Factory. It's a processing point with around 500 members in the co-op. Um, and this is actually Say's first year working with them as well. So we're super excited to have this exclusive. Um, it's a field blend of an SL28, an SL34, a Ruiyu, and a Batian. I apologize for saying Ruiyu are weird. It's a really hard word for me to say. Uh, full admission. And this coffee is depulped, fermented for 24 hours, washed, dry fermented for another 12 to 24 hours, washed again, soaked in really big tanks uh, for about 18 hours, and then finally it is dried on raised beds for about 15 days before it gets to you. So it's got to go through a lot of, um, it's, it goes through a lot to get to you and we're really excited to bring it to you. And those last two pours, remember I went up to 250 grams and then to 350 grams to finish um, on my final pour, which is roughly 12 ounces of total liquid out. It's gonna be a little bit of a slower brewing coffee just because again, um, since it is so light and yet so developed, I wanna push a lot, like a ton, a ton out. So I'm gonna give it a little more extraction time by grinding a little bit finer brewing at a little bit of a hotter temperature and throwing in a little bit of a higher dose. As always, it's really easy to order from fellow drops, exclusive drops like this that you can only get from us. All you gotta do is text us back the number of bags or boxes in this case that you would want. 
uh, one, two, ten, however many. If you don't text us back, uh, we won't charge you or send you any copy. It's as simple as that. Let us know what you think in the comments section, what you'd like to see us to do. Uh, we brewed with Stag X today, but if there's any other brew method that you'd like to see, let me know. We love hearing from you. And as always, thank you so much for joining me, and I'll see you next week.